Hi, welcome to the Quick Street Workshop. In last week's video, um, I connected several coils, experimented with this. And uh, the first one I used was this uh, little magneto from a lawnmower engine. And I wasn't getting satisfactory results. Uh, for some reason, it just completely did not work. And I experimented with other coils and it didn't give me fantastic results. Although um, I revisited it a little bit. And after thinking about it, I connected the the terminals uh, on other on the other cable that came out of the the little uh, magneto, and I got much better results. So the best results I got was from this long uh, magneto. I connected um, the wires from the main high voltage uh, plug wire and that that wire <clears throat> and if I spin it you'll see um, if I spin it immediately jumps up gives me two three volts and the LED shining so that is a very nice result for something off the shelf don't have to make my own coils if you can you can just add a lot of these around and multiply the voltage that way so i've decided to do a little experiment um, i've hanged this piece of aluminium in the wind and connected it on a couple of strings and the strings is running to the magnetic uh, rotor as you can see, um, it's generating power just from the magnets moving back and forth. The strings are just jerking back and forth and the magnets are moving. Uh, just a slight breeze outside and it makes the movement, just a little bit of movement of the magnets. So this uh, concept can be used even uh, scaled up and uh, if you live close to the ocean you can use the waves of the sea to to make this rock back and forth and i'm sure if you scale it up you can generate quite a decent amount of power to charge batteries so even with the scenario of having the a tree branch or something pull uh, pull on a, on, a, on a piece of string and this just goes back and forth like this if you've got a couple of these around and this thing just moves a little bit like that then it is gonna you can see there even just that movement I'm making magnets moving back and forth it's keeping the volts almost three volts and the LED is shining So a little bit of flickering there, but it's not, not too bad. So yes, I think this was a success as a, as a test and maybe I can build something like a wind uh, generator or something. <laughs> 